Margaret Kibathi, NTV. Elsewhere, residents of Nyashafa and Wetedia villages in Juja, that's in Kiambu County, spent most of Saturday morning blocking armed police officers from collecting the body of a middle-aged woman who was mauled to death by a pack of hyenas. The residents accused the Kenya Wildlife Service of negligence due to an increase in the number of attacks by the predators. His interview is Martin Wangi with those details. <laughs> The furious residents were up in arms on Saturday morning in protest after a woman was mauled by hyenas as she went about her business. The woman is said to have been walking from Nyasafa area to some coffee plantation within Georgia for work when she was attacked. She was gravely injured in the stomach and the night before the scavengers abandoned her by the roadside. Act residents denied police opportunity to collect the body since the government has not been doing anything to protect them. In their hundreds, the residents barricaded the road, leading to where the body was lying. As ya leo, sisi tunumeena vitu kombaya sana kwa sababu tutukua tunaendekea kasi tunatoka saa kumi. Tukitoka, mama mwaja tukakuta na kuliwa na fisi. Sasa hiyo fisi iko na ujasiri sana na iko na usujaa sana. Inaonekana iko na nguvu kwa sababu hata ikifukuswa ikifukuswa inakuta hao watu wanaifukusa. Tunataka kujua ni fisi ilichaguana ama ni sisi tulichaguana. Ya pili ni sisi tulinunua hizi maplate ama ni fisi zilinunua. The incident happened days after a nine year old boy was attacked in a similar manner. The boy a center former Retavia Ward MCA was buried a week ago. Kuna wengine wamekulia hiyo ni sasa ni waile. Hata si waile atujui wenye wamekulia wamelewa wamekunywa pepe wakalewa wakakunywa wakaisha. Residents blame the increased hyena attacks to abandon quarries and bushy chunks of land that have remained undeveloped for years. Na kwa hivyo sisi tunataka kuambia watu wa KWS siku ya leo ya kwamba ni wakati wao sasa wachukue wanyama wapeleke wanyama kwenye wako na faida kwa sababu wao wanyama wakiwa hapa kwetu hawana faida yoyote the residents want the abandoned quarries in the area filled as well as clearing the bushes around the area to avert further attacks they also want a KWS camp to be established in the area in order to hunt down the marauding wild animals. The victim's body was later collected and taken to General Cargo Funeral Home as residents joined KWS officers in search of the killer hyenas. Martin Mwangi, NTV. Now the National Authority for the Council